Hi everyone, it's Emilia here. Welcome to my new video. Today I'm coming with a inspiration for lemon craft. This is actually a card created for the lemon craft uh, challenge on Instagram and the card is in a, a mason jar shape. I have a free template available for you to download. Please check the description box below the video. And I'm asking you if you will be using the template, please tag me on social media so I can see your projects. And I will be starting by printing the template out. So there are two ways. You can print it like me on the white card and then cut it out and um, trace it onto your pattern papers or you can print it on the pattern papers straight away. This template can be also used in the cutting machines. I'm not going to use um, in the electronic cutters, I mean, like Cricut and uh, other um, machines, but I will be just uh, uh, cutting it out with the scissors. First of all, I am going to create a card base. I have a folded piece of card. Mine is in a craft brown color, but you can use white or any other color as well, of course. Then um, I will uh, cut the first layer, so still outline of the jar that will be uh, attached to the card base and then I am just going to um, cut out the frame. So on top of the first layer, the second layer will be just frame. Of course, you can do it differently. So you can, uh, instead of um, cutting out the frame, you could actually cut out the rectangle that is uh, inside the jar and have a solid second layer. I hope this makes sense to you. Probably you will know what I mean once I have all the layers cut out. For my project I'm using one of the uh, new Lemon Craft uh, paper collections. This one is called Spring Everywhere. It has beautiful patterns, very pastel colors, light green, yellow, pink and blue, perfect for any spring or Easter projects. For the lid I have used a piece of watercolor paper and I'm just going to uh, lightly emboss it with the embossing tool and with the uh, tracing wheel and then I will use the tracing wheel to decorate the frame.
as you can see the card uh, has three elements apart the card base uh, there is a first like full layer then the frame and then the lid for decorating i have a selection of handmade flowers for all of the flowers i was using lady e design cutting dies i have some uh, artificial leaves some die cut leaves pieces of lace some elements which are fussy cut out of the paper collection and uh, at the end of the video i will be using white acrylic paint of course and some micro bits just to finish off the project At the end of the video you will also see that I have created second card very similar using the same paper collection only I, I made the frame uh, thinner but uh, which one you like better you have to decide for yourself uh, I thought uh, the th uh, thicker frame is actually uh, slightly better because then easily you can attach the double-sided foam pads to it but uh, you decide anyway I'm sure I will be creating uh, more cards like this one and I hope you will too
it's time to add final touches to my card i have these uh, little polystyrene balls and uh, i'm using uh, glue which dries clear so i can uh, add them here and there on my card and then i'm going to add splats of white acrylic paint mixed with water and this will be it for today i hope you will uh, like the card and i'm hoping to inspire you to create a similar project i think it looks really really nice it is fun card uh, fun shape to make it doesn't take a lot of time to cut everything out and it looks just lovely i want to thank you very very much for uh, visiting my channel please tag me on social media if you will be creating a project inspired by my video and as always thank you so much for leaving a comment thanks a lot have a lovely creative day bye bye